Today's high of 102, the hottest since September 24th, and we're on a streak. Not a good one. Six straight days of triple digit temperatures, but Hurricane Barrel could be our ticket to some cooler weather and some beneficial rain. 90 outside right now, heat index still at 91. Luckily, no heat advisories except for Milam County extended through tomorrow. And tomorrow I am forecasting 101 in Austin, 101 in Lano, 97 Blanco and 96 degrees in LaGrange. Then we fast forward to the 4th of July. Upper 70s when you wake up, a little bit of cloud cover for those early parades. 9 a.m. about 83. Afternoon high 102 fireworks time. We're still in the 90s, but it should be dry and hot. Then we're tracking the tropics. Hurricane Barrel, still a category four hurricane. It is heading toward Jamaica next. After that, it's going to head farther west toward the Yucatan Peninsula and then into the Southwest Gulf. And the National Hurricane Center has the official hurricane track just south of the border in far northern Mexico. But that cone of uncertainty does include Texas. And look at all of the possibilities. It's still a huge range, so it's difficult to ascertain exactly what that will mean for Central Texas, except to say rain chances are looking better and temperatures are looking cooler. So we could see anywhere between maybe as little as a quarter of an inch to possibly upwards of three, four, five, six inches. Let's go hour by hour as well, because before barrel affects us, which would be at the earliest Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, we potentially could see a weak front try to get in here on Friday. Now this computer model is really aggressive. It's actually bringing some showers on Friday as that cooler air gently pushes in could stall to our north though. So I'm not terribly convinced that Friday is going to be a much cooler day, but Saturday I've upped the rain chance to 30% and dropped our temperatures into the 90s for what could be several days.